Hello everyone, and this is Medium King Richard. We are in God Eater 3. That's right. God Eater 3. A game I have been so looking forward to for a while now. Let me go ahead and get into this and edit some settings here. Oh, it goes way down. Now I am playing this with a controller because uh, if you know the God Eater series, you don't play this with a uh, keyboard or mouse because that's actually very, very hard to do. Hmm, let's go ahead and get this down because I'm going to be talking. You know, I like having voices, operator voices. Yeah, we're going to keep that the same. Starting a new game here. Now I have played a little bit of this. I wanted to test it out, see how the graphics were, um, see how it's running. Um, and see everything is, and it seems to be running just perfect. It runs fine, but let's get into this. Mm. I just love the stories behind these games, and I love the soundtracks as well, which is just amazing. Yep, everything is melting, just melting. So my memory from God Eater 2 has been easy because it's been so long. I'm going to try and remember everything as best I can, but no guarantees. Hmm, that must be my character. Look so worried. We're not gonna die. I promise you that. Next is PW01408. That's you. Oh, I'm a number now. PW1408. aptitude test. Please try to relax. Stage one, inducing ash blight corruption. <laughs> ash blight corruption oh, has been blight. confirmed. Now progressing to stage two, mounting god arc. So they don't have the guard arc actually to get by it. <laughs> Sounds painful. Suck it up. Progressing to stage three. Final stage. Implanting adaptive oracle cells. Status confirmed. Ash blight corruption has been neutralized. Subjects' vitals have returned to normal. Aptitude is positive. Congratulations. The process is complete. You are now an adaptive God Eater. So you survived. Grade A. Oh, I haven't seen your kind around here before. How does it feel to give up your humanity? Feels pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass now. Oh, no. Never mind. Hey, don't Still go and croak on us, okay? Your life belongs to the port now. You're of no use, dead. Here, I'm gonna need you to sign this contract. Wow, he's such a lovely guard. And we get to go into the character creator. So obviously, our name is not protagonist. Oh, I actually have to use my keeper for this. Give me a second. As always, our character's name is Sar. Go to code name. Not PW1408, it is medium. Medium. 
Okay. Now just to test, you do have a female character you can be. I mean, it's okay. I'm always gonna go with a, a male character. I love how they have the emblem on the back of their uh, the back of the jacket, which is the God Eater emblem. And we have quite a few hairstyles. Shine color. Mm. Ooh, I like that. I do indeed like that. View expression. <laughs> Angry eyes. Kind of like number one. It's plain and simple. We're gonna go for cobalt blue eyes. We're gonna go sea green skin color. Obviously, we're gonna go pale. Accessory A. Hairpin. Oh my gosh. There, there's a lot of customization you can do into these type of games. Um. I know I could spend a lot of time and I could probably try and make my character look as goofy as possible, but...
my character as weird as possible. Well, not as weird as possible, but interesting as possible. I like that. Thanks! Let's wrap it up! Step forth to holy battle! 20 types of voices. Many thanks! D damn you! Eat this! Gotcha! It went pretty much as I expected. Hmm. Guess I'm still up for more. Here we go! Oh yeah! Ah! Owie! Owie! Say your prayers! Ah! Doesn't even hurt! A follow-up blow! Got you! Ah! Ah! Out of my way! I won't let that go unpunished. Ah! I've regained my vigor! Ah! Yes. Meet your maker! Begin mission. Burn to cinders! We're actually gonna go with the, the head plate, the helmet. I don't know. I'll be the blind character that, for some reason, can fight these monsters and seems perfectly fine, even though uh, I don't know why. So you can see I already had a save file. I w played for quite a bit, um, but I wanted to make sure everything was running fine and tested everything. I had a f I ran into a few crashes. Hopefully, I don't run into those again. And I noticed where those Come crashes on. were. So let's go. How can I see? I can't see. I have b I have bandages on my eyes. I can't. I'm not supposed to be able to see. Okay, this is a very dingy... Oh, we're in a cell. Okay. Makes sense. I guess they keep us as prisoners due to our powers. Hey, you okay? You seem pretty out of it. Bad dream or something? Anyway, rise and shine. I went ahead and asked about our next job. Oh, really? What is it, then? It's in a pretty thick spot. Looks like there's not too much time left for you and me, huh? Fighting an ash this thick will ruin a body in no time. And if we can't work? Well, I doubt the folks at the port will want to look after us. Mm, lovely. Eventually, we're either going to run out of the bias factor we need to live, or we'll end up as origami snacks or bait, and that'll be that. Mm. A time-honored end for ages like you and me. Mm. Yeah, well, that's not gonna happen to us. I promise. You so sure about that? After all, we've got too much riding on our shoulders. We'll keep going for the ones we couldn't save. It's a vow I made to them all. I'm never going to give up, no matter what happens. So, that's that. We are not dying. The two of us will keep moving forward, on to whatever tomorrow brings. Yeah, I'm blind, so I can't see anything, so... Handcuffed and blind. New accessories A and B have been added. So, you can walk around when you're just moving, but if you pull on the trigger, it's a right bumper, you can actually run. And, like, I'm gonna be running everywhere because this is incredibly slow. Like, you're like, oh, yes, I can move. I can move fast now. And then you're like, Rrr. let's go ahead. Here you can change equipment, manage consumables, and view the database. You can also save your game here. Yep. So let's go to loadout. Here you can uh, edit equipment such as god arc parts, bullets, and clothing. You can also ha save equipment sets, which allows you to easily re-equip them. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a little bit tired.
So here's our weapons. We have knife, blade, buster, maul, lance, scythe, twin, and ring. So the knife is kind of like a one-handed sword. Because they call it a knife. But if I come out of that, that is not a knife. I mean, that is a freaking sword. Which is nice. Um, you have the actual sword, which is more like a claymore. And then you have the actual claymore, which is more like a massive maul. Um, you have the hammer, which is a hammer. And look at this thing. That's a hammer. Brr, hammer time. Brr, do, do, do. Um, the lance, which I'm actually fond of the lance in this game. Don't get me wrong. Um, you have the scythe. Another one I'm fond of, I will use the scythe as well because I do like it. Um, we have the twin daggers, which is what we just saw. Now those will look more a little bit more like, uh, I guess, daggers. We have this thing, the ring. Now I'm actually very interested in using the ring. Um, and I might go with it. I'm not 100% sure. But we also have, you also get a rifle. So you have a machine gun, uh, a sniper, a shotgun, and then a Wazer rifle. And I sit here and I go, I don't know which one I want to use. <sighs> and I didn't know that you can actually sell these down at the bottom with that, so I don't want to sell that. Um... They all have the same special ability. Another thing I found really interesting is that start actually doesn't change anything. But back actually is your backspace. Um, this is where you can view your skills, like reduce stamina costs for actions according to level. We have initiative. So increase melee attack speed according to level. And then reduces damage taken according to level. So I'm actually gonna go with the laser. We have our shields. We have the buckler. We have an actual shield. And then we have the tower. Um, Depending on which one you pick, it means how fast they deploy. It's a significant shield. It really is. And then with the ring, we get that. <laughs> but... Um, so... To give you an idea, the weapons I normally use in this game, because they didn't have the ring and they didn't have the twin in God Eater 2, I use the scythe and the lance, and I use the actual blade itself. Those are the three weapons I used. I never really used the maul. I didn't like it. It just has such a slow attack speed, and it only does crush damage, which crush is not bad when you're destroying the Arg because the armor army has armor. It destroys the Aragami's armor, so that's why I use the Buster Blade, because it does crush and slash, so it does increase damage when armor is broken, and it breaks armor. Um, this also has a bit of a slash and a crush as well, which is why I wanted to use it. Um, it definitely does more damage um, than crushing. The Scythe is just cutting, and the Lance is piercing, which, if they have armor, it doesn't matter. So, it's... With the lands. This guy's. Okay, and we get to talk to Hugo. You can double check the details on the monitor. They said it's high density ass acclimation. Get prepared as the, as the terminal and let's move out. Ashes, the suffocation is requested for new zones of action. Please execute acclimation programs 216 through 234. You can accept missions. You can also filter the mission list by selecting the mission type and rank. One. Glitchy video display. D1 certification. 
D1 ash uh, density certification. Due to scheduled operations in high density ash environments, the following personnel are required to complete the program PW01408, which is us, and PW01407, which is him. Yep. Here you can choose which allies will accompany you on the mission, set an ally into an empty slot to have them join you on your mission. I can't remove him. <laughs> Mission acceptance uh, confirmed. Any unforeseen accidents during the mission are your own responsibility. Be extra careful to ensure that guard arcs remain undamaged. Once you, ex you accept the mission, you can talk to the guard and head out. Are you heading out? Don't worry. If you don't come back, it can e I can easily replace the whole lot of you. You better not ha think about making a will either. I've used to deal with the paperwork opening the door now. Well, you're such a lovely guard. Just such a lovely guard. Just, wow. Across. What team are you with? Requesting salvage! Please! I don't want to die! Forget them. They're already origami, Chow. You've got your own jobs to do, so get to them. Hurry up and let us loose. I am now releasing the restraints on Pennyward Ages Hound 1 and Hound 2. Dogs, sick em. I'm limiting your operation area. If you try to do any moonlighting, well, you know what happens. Yeah, we know. Shall we? We'll make it out of this. There's so much going on in this map, it's you were given and ridiculous. The Ashlands. Once you've acclimated, return immediately. The fetters will be written off. That is all. Something unexpected might happen. If it does, I'll use my own judgment. Unnecessary combat may result in the loss of God Arcs. Thus, fighting is prohibited. Proceed with tests to confirm effectiveness in high ash density conditions. Yeah, yeah. How are you doing? I think I'm all right. I'm fine. I'm perfectly fine. Are you disoriented? Look straight ahead for me. I wish I could skip the tutorial, but well, I can't. You should be fine then. Let's we move. have to go through Follow the tutorial. Me. Follow me. You're following. You're following me. I want to follow you. This is a big arsehole. Plastic. I want to come down there. Set. 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 You've got no business in that area. Move back. Another team is operating there. Yeah, sure. The ones with their wires crossed? Keep a safe distance. Let's play it safe for now. It's funny how no matter how hairy it gets, I always have fun when you're around. If you find high ground, climb on up. It's always an advantage in a fight. Looking down on origami crawling beneath you feels pretty good too. This is Bull One! I'm surrounded by origami! Requesting salvage! This is Hound One. I'm at Point Alpha. Can you break through their line? Understood. I'll get through somehow. You do not have permission to transmit. You want to get written up? Hey, you can't blame me for being curious. Idiot. Still got some stamina? It's easy to get winded this deep in the Ashlands. Do you read me? I made it through the line. 
en route to point Alpha. All right, we'll clear out the origami in the area. Proceed with caution. You go. I owe you for this. You do not have permission to transmit. Don't make me tell you again. You haven't completed the acclimation program. Proceed with your assigned mission. If we can fight this deep in the Ashlands, who gives a crap about acclimation? You'll be disciplined for insubordination. I hope you're ready for that. Sure, whatever you say. Now quit looking over my shoulder. I hate this Saying we're fighting in dense so ash is enough of an excuse, right? So You'll regret this. Lag. No, but it doesn't bother you guys that much. Form too. See if you can transform for me. I can transform. Finish it. Yes. Yes. More company. Let's go. I'll put it max. OP. You can fight in blade form to restore your supply. Yep. I have you! so easily. Nobody's got time to wipe your nose for you here. Okay, time to head home and get in our cells. Fifty for that? Are you kidding me? Mm. Don't worry. Everyone made it back okay. A good result for us. Yeah. We might do as the port folks want. Work ourselves to the bone. Get dragged to hell and back. But that doesn't mean we're willing to give up our lives without a good fight. A place where ages can live out their lives without being controlled or pushed around by anyone. That's what we need, right? Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> the guards went to town on you this time, didn't they? Bet that hurts. You never do as you're told, huh? Bet it's hell getting teamed up with this guy. <laughs> I didn't know you were back from patrol, Zeke. 
Yep, that's right. All done with my work for today. Listen, man, next time you should come out with me. Come on. I thought you were smarter than that. Having a chance to work with THE Zeke Pennyworth should be enough to make you weep for joy. <laughs> Maybe you should mention how good you are. <laughs> Hugo's always so by the book. It must have been boring out there with him. Come on, I'll show you a real cool trick next time. This isn't a sport, Zeke. Look, I know that. You think I don't know that? Anyway, did you hear the recent news? One of the other teams was saying that a port nearby got swallowed by the ash. That's the first I've heard of it. But it's not exactly news for ports to get engulfed by the Ashlands. Sure, it's no surprise when it's some base somewhere. But how will you feel when the ash is creeping closer and closer? Are you talking about an ash storm? Yeah, well... If one of those ash storms does come through, it's not like there's a whole lot we can do other than strap in and pray, right? Sure. Yeah, that's about the size of it. Though, even then, riding one out isn't all that realistic. Yep. Let's go ahead and talk to Zeke. I just got back and there's already more work waiting for me. I guess if you're as good as me, you're always in demand. You know what I mean, right? Not really. Huh? Okay, whatever. The thing is, is there's a problem with my God Arc shield deployment, so I'm benched for now. <laughs> Remember the fallen comrades. Oh. Multiplayer, connecting to a server, find a team, create a team. Oh. Allies and personnel. Code name Hugo. Code name Zeke. Love that sound. Let's go ahead. I'm going to call it good for today, guys. I know we only got through one, one, through one tutorial mission. There's like four. Um, I'll probably in the next episode go ahead and get through the rest of them, but this was mainly the introduction to the game, getting through all the videos at the start of it, and getting everything here done, getting my character created and all that, and I know that takes a little bit of time, and I do apologize, but I do want to thank you guys so much for coming out and watching my video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and you guys stay awesome!